Okay, let's go through the main characteristic of our new A Compu test. A Compu test is our portable Rockwell uh, hardened tester, which has a native scale, uh, which is Rockwell basically, uh, with uh, a spring loaded system. Uh, the me measuring range here is a uh, SLC, SLB, uh, HP30, uh, and then we, we can have uh, Vickers, uh, but also DPTH, which is depth. Uh, the repeatability of the instrument is up to, uh, uh, bet I would say, better than 1% or plus minus 0.3 HRC. Um, we have all available scales, uh, you can choose uh, uh, whatever scale you would uh, prefer to use for your testing procedure. Um, uh, so, uh, the system is not influenced by, by mass uh, and uh, because of the 5 kilos load, it can measure up to uh, or less, but less than 1 millimeter thickness. Um, well, uh, this is the main characteristic of the, of the instrument. We shall also consider a couple of things which are uh, very, very important for, for, a portable, uh, for a portable unit like this. Um, the, the, the first thing is that you can use the instrument and you can test and you can measure uh, in all directions. So you, you can measure upside down, you can measure in this direction, in this direction, so there is no problem even if you have a uh, difficult, uh, uh, difficult sample, uh, difficult to reach, uh, uh, then you can, you can measure in the way uh, you, you, you prefer and uh, it's more easy for you. Uh, this is a wireless unit. Uh, remember, as I told you before, uh, it can transfer data uh, to, uh, the, uh, to this unit here um, up, to, up to a range of uh, 100 meters, which, uh, which, which is, I would say, very, very interesting. Um, okay, uh, as you can see, this unit has no cable and also uh, it can be recharged wireless using a, a special base for, for recharge. Okay, let's try the A Compo test on a, on a sample, a uh, known sample of 59.8 SUC. Okay, let's place on the surface. Let's make sure you point out on, a, on the right spot. All this with one hand and with the other and let's start to press, make sure you have five kilos more or less. Let's wait and then back slowly. You got 59.7, which is exactly what you should be, 59.8 plus minus 05. That's perfect. For agar accuracy, we can transform our portable unit into a bench instrument. Very simple. Let's remove the base standard base. Let's place the instrument on the bench. Pressing. Let's tighten a little bit and let's start with the measurement. 